everyone, welcome to DMFA Digital Marketing for Asia. My name is Joanna and I am a marketing manager working here at SoftBank Telecom Europe. Line is Japan's most popular social media platform with over 94 million users, which makes it an excellent platform for advertisers and marketers to build loyal communities and drive sales. In this video, I will guide you through the process of setting up basic ID and premium ID for your Line official account and discuss what you need to pay close attention to in order to pass line ads account review but before we go as usual please don't forget to subscribe to our dmfa channel are you ready let's go in order to promote anything online advertisers must go through numerous steps which include an ad account application campaign setup and payment method registration all of these can be completed online on top of that before you can use line for advertising your ad account and all of the connected content and assets must go through a very rigorous review process this includes not only ads and its content like images or text but also the account itself it is a very crucial area as the account may fail the review due to mistakes in the information provided during the application or for not meeting the advertising requirements. Line may refuse to open an advertising account at its sole discretion based on the following criteria. Can the advertised content cause problems or lead to dissatisfaction among Line users? Is there any possibility of violating the law? Does the advertised content violate Line's terms of use or is there a risk of this happening in the future? Does it adversely affect Line's business or damage its reputation? Does it meet other criteria set independently by Line? We have to remember that Line's users are people from, you know, young teenagers to those over 65 years old. So in order to have your Line uh, ads account approved, you must ensure that the content you want to promote and services and products are safe for everyone and that they meet Line's advertising guidelines. If you want to learn more about opening a Line ads account, I'm going to put a link to one of our blog articles in the description down below so make sure to check this out after you watch this video as well in order to acquire a basic id or a premium id for your line official account you must meet the following requirements basic or premium id cannot be created nor managed without the advertiser's permission if you're acting on behalf of the advertiser you must obtain their permission prior to setting up the basic or premium id basic id or premium id account display name must be related to the advertiser or provided services line users see it alongside the ads and it should clearly indicate what kind of products or services are being promoted and basic uh, slash premium ID profile photo must be related to the advertiser or the promoted products or services. Additionally, it is important to remember that the basic or premium ID account display name must meet the following conditions. First of all, it has to include the official name of the business, a corporation, organization, or an individual, or advertised products or services. Second point is that it does not use names of non-existent businesses, products or services. And number three, it doesn't use phrases that may be untrue or misleading. The display name also shouldn't be misidentified as a product or service advertised by Line or any of Line's affiliates. A basic ID or premium ID that does not meet these conditions may have their ad account suspended regardless or whether or not they serve ads. Setting up a basic ID or premium ID for your Line Ads account requires careful attention to detail and must comply with Line's advertising policies. DMFA, Digital Marketing for Asia, is a part of the SoftBank family and we are also Line's official partners. So if you're interested in advertising your products in Japan, online, but you don't know where to start or you're struggling with opening the official account or maybe you are not sure 
uh, how to open the ads account please make sure to get in touch with us as usual i'm going to put a link to the contact form in the description down below and that's it for today thank you so much for watching i hope you could learn something more about setting up the basic and premium id for your line ads account as usual please don't forget to subscribe to our dmfa channel give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and don't forget to put on the notification bell we post new videos every monday and yeah i think that's it for today so once again thank you so much and i will see you again very very soon in the next one bye